it's winter here in Southern California, and this is my favorite time of the year to grow vegetables. I want to give you four reasons for that. It's um, uh, the first one is the rain waters your vegetables for you. That saves time. Rainwater is the best kind of water. Makes it so easy compared to the, the other dry seasons for us in Southern California. Another reason is you uh, have certain root diseases that kind of go dormant in the winter. These are carrots, for example, and carrots are susceptible to root knot nematodes. Here's some lettuce. Lettuce is also susceptible to root knot nematodes, but the nematodes aren't active in the winter, so you can grow these crops if you have that problem in your, in your dirt. Um, another reason is that you can, uh, you can grow some crops that you just can't grow in the summer. Here are peas. You're not going to grow good peas in the summer. And down here, these are, um, well, these are, this is garlic. You can only grow that in the winter here. This is broccoli. You can only grow broccoli in the winter. Cauliflower. Here's some cauliflower heads coming on. I don't know if you can see that. <laughs> but you can only grow that stuff in the winter. So that's another reason. Another, the other reason is, the fourth reason is that it's just so pleasant to be out here working in the, in the garden. If you've got weeding to do, if you've got planting or harvesting, it's such a nice temperature. Morning, afternoon, evening, it's uh, comfortable all day long here in the winter in Southern California compared to summer, especially if you live inland where it's so hot and you've got to get your stuff harvested early morning and so on. So those are my four reasons. I hope you uh, don't have an empty vegetable bed this winter, or if you do, you should get something planted.